up everybody today <laughs> uh but what's up guys as you see from the title we're doing the top 10 i mean uh, face palm <laughs> bro but seriously uh so we're doing uh, season five skins the worst to best because season you because you all know that season five is gonna end in like eight hours i believe uh, season 6 is coming in 1 o'clock, PST, 4 o'clock, uh, I mean, 1 o'clock Pacific Standard Time, uh, 4 o'clock Eastern Time, yeah, most of my subscribers are from PST, so, 1 o'clock, guys, <laughs> uh, but, let's start off the video with Hasavat, this is my least favorite skin in the season 5 battle pass, not my least favorite of all time, though. All time, we'll get to a different skin. But, for now, bro, this skin's trash. I know it looks like Peter Pan, but screw that. Hasavat, I think that's how you pronounce it. What kind of name is that? And look at his hair. No, no, no. Bro. Ah, look at his shoes. Bro, like, it's so unbelievable. Uh, we're trying to skip as fast as possible between the bad skins because we don't want to spend too much time on them since there's like 50 plus skins in this. <laughs> so, next skin is Mullet Marauder. That thing looks like a, eight, a dad. Bro, if I'm spending $15 on a, on a game so I could look like a dad, bro. What do you mean? It's not even a good dad. It's an 80s dad. Like, what? What do you mean, brother? Uh, but next uh, is Garrison. What did Epic think? Bro, they need to like get rid of some army skins, bro. They gotten too many. And who names your character? Garrison. I know there's people like Shane, Maverick, Fortune, and Moniker. But Garrison? Hello? Who named this kid? Like, what? Bro, whoever named this guy should get fired. Also, this is basic based on my own opinion. So, you can comment down any... Comment down your favorite skin on the on the video. Uh, and I'll see if, if you like the same thing as me. I respect people's opinions. And you guys should respect mine. Like, come on, guys. Be nice. Uh, but next is Aerobic Assassin. Bro, if I'm trying to spend $15 on a game, trying to look like a mom, not even a good mom, it's an 80s mom. Like, what? Uh, yeah, it's basically the same thing as Marauder. Wild card, hmm, shocker. But, I don't actually really like this. I think it's a huge rip off of John Wick. The only, because remember guys, you're seeing the, the back side of it. And what's on the back side? Just a white version of John Wick. Literally. Like, what? You could just wear the white out. Literally. It's just both a white, clean skin. And not. I'm not trying to be racist. I'm just saying they're clothes. Literally. White out. Literally. Just wear the white out. It's even cheaper. <laughs> I don't understand why people wear wild parts. It just looks so dumb. And the far out man is next. That thing looks like another dead. It looks even worse. It looks like a 70s dad. <laughs> uh, <I'm laughs> I love doing my job. <laughs> but next is Dream Flower. Yeah, 70s mom. Uh, Musha, his mask. What is that? And most importantly, what is this bat bleed? No, no, no. What is those? What are those? Like, oh my gosh. It's unbelievable. Next is Mass Fury. Uh... not hate him look at that dude he looks like he has a gut to fight a five-year-old bro he looks like one of those guys <laughs> that you see at school <laughs> uh the backbone what i'm not really into mo oh never mind i like the white out i can't say nothing about my, like motor skins well i'm not a big fan of most motor skins as i like the burnout red light uh, never mind. This is the only motorcycle skin that I don't like for some reason. 
Like, I like motor, motor skins. They're pretty cool. Like, Overtaker, Wida. <laughs> I'm sorry. Excuse me. And, like, Burnout, Redline. They're pretty cool. Except Backbone. Like, who names him that? His back bling is sucks. I forgot to talk about the back blings, but his back bling sucks so far. Uh, Royal Bomber, uh, $400 for a piece of crap. Last time I put him on my top 10 least favorite skins, he changed because I realized I was just going off of, like, the front. And now it's got, like, the back, like, matches back bling. Pretty matches, like, good stuff. But, like, it like, doesn't show that ugly face, bro. And you're paying four hundred dollars for that, so that's why so low. Stage Slayer, his hair. That's the problem, bro. And his his drum is too bulky to fit on skins. Uh, next, Valkyrie. Uh, I really don't like her. her hair. Just ruins everything. Like her hair's too big and stuff. And I think that her wings are too wide apart. Like close in it, please. Epic Games. And uh, next is Charge Trooper, bro. Come on now. He looks like a doctor who's who like, he's doing a medic challenge, bro. Like, that guy is a medic. He's not a fighter, bro. He looks like an idiot. Tell me he doesn't look like an idiot. Like, come on now. <clears throat> so. Oh, what are you doing? My sister's literally under me. You're interrupting. Uh. I'm back. After like five minutes, my sister ruined everything. Uh, but let's get back. So, what's next? Uh, Galaxy. Yeah. I mean, I like the Galaxy, but not as much where you would pay a thousand dollars to get a skin. Like, come on, guys. What has our humanity become? Like, come on. What has our, like,. Come on, guys. Are you really spending $1,000 not on, like, family stuff? And uh, unless you really need, like, a new phone or, or you're spoiled. Yeah, I understand that. Or a big, like, streamer, YouTuber where you need it. Yeah. But who would just spend randomly $1,000 just to get a skin? Like, come on now. <sighs> Next is Armadillo. It's pretty cool, but is it better than the others? No. Uh, Suntan Specialist. <sighs> When you look at the Sun Strider, you're like, cool. Then you look at the boy. You're like, eh. Like, he looks like one of those bullies. <laughs> Since Star, uh, her leg thingies, I don't really like them. Also, she looks too, like, 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 grown up. Like, she looks, like, kind of old with that face. Like, uh, she's using that, like, that, that ginger hair girl. Uh, Fortune. Bro, I do not like these normal skins. Like, who do you think they are? Like, they're just normal, random Fortnite characters. Like, this is why Fortnite's so cool, other than the building. Like, they're cartoonish characters in game. Like, that makes the game so much fun. But then they come up with average people. Like, what? So is Moniker, which is next on our list. I don't even continue to know what, what number are we on. Uh... And next is Shade. Literally, what is going on with these random skins? And no, next is not Maverick. Next is Eon. It came out today with the Xbox pack. Uh, where you buy the new Xbox bundle, Xbox One S. You get 2,000 V-Bucks, the Eon set. Hey, bro, this, it's it's a reskin. Literally, the, the, it's a basically a reskin of everything. The skin's a reskin of the, the... The Criterion, the pickaxe, the uh, the pickaxe is a reskin of the onslaught, uh, and the glider is I forgot the name. It's the 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 reskin of the archetypes glider. Next is war paint. Uh, for paying like thirty dollars, you get one. Wait, when it first came out, it cost twenty dollars, and people bought it. Literally, you're getting two. You're getting a free skin. Literally. But, uh, come on. War paint. Uh, he doesn't look that good, to be honest. I don't like his thingy over his head. Next is Chopper. The only reason I like the skin is the back bling, bro. Like, the back bling and her, like, her helmet looks pretty cool. Uh, but other else, it doesn't look good. And here's Maverick. Yeah. The only reason he's up so high is because his back bling. Bat attitude. 
It's really cool. Next is Enforcer. I ripped my butt for this skin. Seven weeks of challenges are hard, man. I know I just completed all ten weeks, but I just, I just grinded, bro. Bro, like, it's so hard to get the Enforcer skin, bro. Like, it was kind of disappointing. Like, the backbling, though, is pretty cool. That's why it's so up so high. It's like season four all over again. We're good skin, underwhelming skin. I mean, good backbling, underwhelming skins. Yeah. Next is Recreator. It's too dull. I don't like the, the sharks. Eh, it's okay, I guess. Ian Jonesy in a shark costume. I mean, uh, and wearing like the, the hold up. I'll come back. I just had to go poop. <laughs> so next is the Chomp Senior. It's really good for the backling. It's really cool. I like the creativity, but it's not going with me. Next is the Peekaboo. I like the clown skins, but this one, the Peekaboo, uh, it's just under detailed, bro. And it's purple. I like the red one version, bro. It's under detailed. Backlink, eh, that's not, eh. And next is Archetype. This skin, at first, I really hated it, but now, I'm starting, it's starting to grow on me, but not that much. So, uh, yeah, I'm, let's just get, let's just grind through this quickly. Uh, next is Grill Surgeon, Shush, Grill Surgeon, eh, it's okay, I guess. Uh, for uh, Uncommon Skin, it's pretty good. It should be rare. Sushi Master. It has a back bling and it's pretty cool. And it's sushi. I love sushi as Asian. Magnus was the first thing to came out in the item shops. I'm pretty sure. The back bling is pretty cool. And it's honestly, it looks pretty cool as a as a Viking. I like his helmet. Next is the roasting leader. It's really good. If you wear like the six string on it, it's great. Uh, nothing else to say. It's pretty clean. It's clean. Uh, sledgehammer. Uh, it's pretty good for. Uh, I feel like it should be lower. Like, I feel like Sunstrider and and sledgehammer should have switched places. But huh, who cares? I still got them. Uh, Jaime or him? Heim? I'm just gonna say Heim. It's a really good skin, bro. The back bling goes with every skin, bro. I promise you, bro. It goes with every skin. And if you put the dark wings on the Heim, it looks bomb. Uh, Huntress, and eh, it's okay. I think people, it's, I think it's underrated because Drift is right on tier 1, 2. And people just like Drift because it's customizable. Overtaker, uh, from, uh, the male version of Whiteout. <laughs> uh, but it's pretty cool. I like the back blade. Pretty good. I like the black and white. Ace, uh... Uh, it's pretty good for a starter pack, not gonna lie. I'm gonna buy it soon. Just for the V-Bucks. Next is the Beef Boss. How can you unlike him? He, bro, he's part of the big-headed group. <laughs> but next is Reef Ranger. Hold up, Beef Boss has one of the best gliders of all time. Facts. Like, how do you not like that squirting thing? Uh, but uh, Reef Ranger, ah, oh, damn it. Hasavat has a, honestly the best glider of all time. That moving, yeah, but does it really match up for his stoop? Oh, the stupidity. No, uh, red line. I mean, Reef Ranger. Reef Ranger is next. Uh, it's pretty cool. I like the. I like that female like character. Like they should use that character model for a lot of skins. That's pretty cool. And yellow and black. It's pretty cool. Red line. Uh, it's pretty good skin. In my opinion, it's better than Burnout. I feel, I feel like everybody, everybody, everybody agrees with that. <laughs> my mouth. Uh, but, yeah. It goes good with the, the Subjugator, the Enforcer Backling. Yeah. Scorpion, it's so clean, bro. Uh, nothing else to say. It's super clean. The Panda Team Leader. Uh, it's really cool. I know it's just reskin, but the back bling is really cool, and I love pandas. It's pretty cool. Sunstrider's next. I do not like Sunstrider, bro. It's like... <laughs> uh, it's only tier 47, so it's really easy to get. So, yeah. A lot of people should have had it. If you don't, just grind. It's not that hard. Just play 50v50. Uh, next is the Field Surgeon. Bro. That's a pretty cool skin, like, not gonna lie. 
Like, how do you not like that skin, bro? It's a medic. Like, it looks pretty cool in the back bling. Eh, it's okay, I guess, but hold up. I'll come back. Uh, yeah, so. Next is the Cloak Star. I know it doesn't have a back bling, but it's coming soon. It's the Ghost Portal. It's pretty cool. Dude, if you put the the shade back bling, like her back bling on the Cloak Star, it looks amazing, bro. Like, that's the... Shade's back bling's only... The only thing that goes with Shade's back bling is Shade and Cloak Star, bro. Like, facts. Rook, it's a good skin. At first, I thought it was useless, bro. I hated that skin. But, bro, I love this skin now, bro. It goes good with so many back blings. If you put the, like, the Frost thingy, the 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 Ragnarok's back bling on it, like, the like, Tier 3 Ragnarok, you get it, the cape. If you put it on her, it's great, bro. Oh, and if you put the, the, the Whiteout's back bling, the Katana, it looks pretty cool, too. Uh, next is Drift. I love Drift, bro. It's such a good skin. How do you not like Drift? The electricity? Here's the only problem about Drift. It would have been, like, so higher, like, number one. Be it would have not gone, like, to number three. But here's the problem. Tier four Drift? I don't really like the coat. It's too big. But with tier five, it, ma it makes the coat better because it has electricity. Number three is Ragnarok. I love Ragnarok, bro. I wear that all the skin, all the time, bro. If you put the like uh, the goodie bag, the the katana, and the subjugator and the the cape, it looks pretty good on Ragnarok. And tier five Ragnarok, mwah, that's great. Next is Whiteout. Yes, bro. You thought it'd be number one. <laughs> If you've been paying attention, you should know who's number one. But I love Whiteout. My first ever skin bought, so I'm kind of biased. I have the skin, so. <laughs> but, yeah. It's a pretty cool skin. It matches a lot of back blings. Uh, recently, I've been using the goodie bag on it. Looks pretty good. Try it out if you have the skin. And it's only 15,000 V-Bucks, bro. Like, it's cheap. Well, not cheap, but... But I think it should be legendary. Actually, no, I, I, I wouldn't have you bucks to buy it. But oh wait, I would have. <laughs> I bought the extra just in case. But yeah, next is Ravage. Hold up, before wide out back blings go with like everything. I promise you. But next is Ravage. Her back bling goes with everything too. She oh, guys don't remember I put I put Raven at number three, and I say every girl skin. It's basically better. Basically, every girl skin is a better version of their boy skin. This is a great example of one. If I love Raven and it's number three on my top ten favorite list, which is like, I think it's on. In my, it's still one of my. Raven has to be in like top three. Ravage, bro, has to be number one. Like, how do you not like it? It's so sick. But, uh, hope you guys enjoy, uh, leave a like if you enjoy this video, comment, what's your favorite skin, and, and subscribe for more game, co gaming content, uh, yeah, see you guys in season 6, actually, there's a video coming soon, so, see you in that video, I guess, peace. So, hmm. what's up, guys? <laughs> Oh, yeah, yeah. So what's up everybody today? <laughs> uh but what's up guys? As you see from the title, we're doing the top ten I mean uh, face palm <laughs> Bro but seriously uh so we're doing uh, season five skins the worst to best cause season you because you all know that season five is gonna end in like eight hours i believe uh season six is coming in one o'clock pst four o'clock uh i'm at one o'clock pacific standard time uh